Hi, it's John. It's the 15th of May 2016 and I'm at Wimborne Minster and there's a little nature reserve here. Um, obviously horse chestnut tree, slightly different variety with the um, pink blossom rather than the normal white and this is what's known as God's Acre, little nature reserve and it's got a sign telling you what, what's here. Obviously there's a lot of cow parsley. Um, it isn't actually mentioned on here, the cow parsley. Um, God's Acre is managed as a wildlife garden within the living churchyard scheme of the D Dorset Wildlife Trust. And one of the things it's got here is the blue tit. And I've just seen a blue tit here and filmed it. So that was lucky. So I can put that on. And I can see that there is also um, foxgloves in flower, which are the first foxgloves in flower I've seen this year. So uh, very nice little area. I'll just kind of walk around and see if I can see any other things. Um, I can see here... Uh, a geranium which is well it's a sort of semi wild flower but it's good for bees and the uh, bluebells here are over the blackbird that was mentioned on the thing blackbird thistle and moon daisies Various other wildflowers, including a, a euphorbia type thing, which I don't quite know the name of, but very nice at this time of year because of the greens. And lupins. And one over there. seat to sit on whilst you're looking at the garden and a bumblebee. This is what people are very keen on nowadays. Bumblebee with all the pollen in its um, socks as my mother-in-law used to say. I don't know whether I can get it on the... there it is. Oh yeah there it is. So that's nice. And that is actually on the perennial geranium. So now I'm actually sat on the seat looking at the wild areas and what a good idea to have wild areas in a churchyard for wildlife. So although it's a wildlife area it's still consecrated ground and people don't want the dogs on it. Anyway that's it for now. Bye. Bye.